Mastering Subtle English. Understanding under one's breath. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're exploring a very interesting phrase that you might have come across in conversations, books, or movies, under one's breath. This phrase is a wonderful example of how English can capture the subtle nuances of human emotions and actions. So, let's get started and unlock the secrets behind this expression. When someone speaks, under one's breath, they are speaking softly and quietly, usually because they do not want to be heard by others. It's often used to express a private thought, feeling, or reaction that the speaker does not wish to share openly. This can be out of frustration, anger, disbelief, or any other emotion that one might prefer to keep somewhat concealed. To better understand how under one's breath is used, let's look at a few examples. 1. After making a mistake during his presentation, Jake muttered an apology under his breath, hoping his boss wouldn't notice. 2. Sarah laughed under her breath when she saw her friend's reaction to the surprise party, it was exactly as she had predicted. 3. This is going to be a long day, he said under his breath, as the line at the coffee shop stretched out the door. These examples show how the phrase can be used in different contexts to convey a range of subtle emotions and thoughts. While we're not using phonetic transcriptions, it's important to know that when saying, under one's breath, the emphasis is usually on the word, breath. The phrase should be spoken in a lower volume than your normal speaking voice, mimicking the action it describes. Practicing this will help you not only understand the phrase better but also use it correctly in your conversations. Understanding under one's breath also involves grasping its cultural significance. In many English-speaking cultures, openly expressing negative emotions or criticism is sometimes frowned upon. Thus, speaking under one's breath can be a way of expressing oneself without breaking social norms. This nuance is important for learners to appreciate the phrase's full meaning and use. And there you have it. We hope this video has shed light on the meaning and usage of the phrase, under one's breath. It's a powerful expression that captures the essence of speaking softly and privately, often reflecting our innermost thoughts and feelings. Remember, mastering such phrases will not only enhance your English vocabulary but also your ability to express nuanced emotions and thoughts. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more insightful content. Happy learning!